In the following tutorial we are going to talk about human reference, distance, how to measure distance, and how to keep your world to scale. And here in this world, right now, it's very hard to tell how large this actual environment is. And when you begin building landscapes in CryEngine, it becomes very difficult to get a sense of overall scale of the world. So if we get a little bit closer, it's a little bit easier to tell because of the texture reference on our terrain. But even at that point, it's very hard to kind of get a sense of how large this area is. Now the first part is we can jump inside the game and take a look at from the point of view of the player. So if we go ahead and control G, we can take a look around and see, get a better view of the world and how large it actually is. Another way is if we get down low enough to the ground, we'll get a better view of the world without jumping in the game as well. So a few other helpful things that I would recommend is begin to place objects to get a reference scale from them. So by going up to the objects roll up bar tab, clicking on brush, and placing any of the objects that you have inside CryEngine. So we can go ahead and place a couple of structures. Let's say we want to place a building. Let's go to fishing house and let's place this fishing house right into the world and here we get a better sense of how large this environment is, this area of terrain, uh, in compared to the rest of the landscape. So we get down low to the point of view of the player and we have a better sense of the scale of the world. So by placing objects into the world, let me turn on one delays that I currently have, and placing them in a distance and get an overall sense of where the objects are in the landscape. You get a better sense of the proportion and the entire scale. Here we have an object in the distance, we have a house up close, and now we get a better understanding of the distance between these two objects and the overall landscape proportion. Another very helpful tool is to place a human reference scale into your terrain. So by going up to Objects, clicking on Entity, open up AI, we can place an AI character right into the world and this will give us a human reference scale. So we're going to use Grunt. Left click, drag, and right into the world. And by placing them into our landscape, we get another helpful tool to get a better judging of the world scale. And one more tool to get a better understanding of the distance between objects and between large distances of space is we can use the ruler tool. You can find it up here, up in the toolbar. Let's left click it, enable it, and what we do is we place two markers and it will measure the distance in between. So let's zoom out. So let's place one marker here where our human reference scale is. Let's click to place it and then let's place a second one and let's place it by this lighthouse. This will measure the distance between these two markers and currently it's at 488 meters. So by having a few options of jumping in the world, getting down low to the ground, placing objects that give a better sense of proportion and scale, placing a human reference scale and using the ruler tool will give you enough tools to kind of better understand and get your world in proportion and to scale.